Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a moment when one of the game's greatest players, Larry Bird, gave Michael Jordan possibly the highest compliment of all time. We're talking about Bird's iconic statement where he acknowledged that in his era, Michael Jordan was simply better than all of them. Let's dig into why Larry's words carry so much weight in the never-ending GOAT debate. Larry Bird was a man known for not wasting his words. He's not one to make bold claims or engage in debates just for the sake of it. Unlike some of his peers, Bird doesn't often voice his opinion on who the GOAT is. But when he does speak, you know it's coming from a place of deep respect and understanding of the game. So when Bird praised Michael Jordan during the NBA 75 campaign video, it was more than just a compliment. It was an endorsement from one legend to another. Bird said, and I quote, Michael can beat you in a lot of ways. He can beat you mentally, he can beat you physically, he can guard you, he can score. I know in my time he was better than all of us. That's high praise coming from someone who played against the best of the best during his career. Let's put this into some context. Larry Bird was at the top of the NBA when Michael Jordan first entered the league. Bird was the reigning MVP and his Boston Celtics were a powerhouse. As the leader of the Celtics dynasty, Bird knew what it took to be great. He faced Jordan 34 times during his career, winning 17 of those matchups in the regular season and all six postseason games against Jordan and the Bulls. Despite getting the better of MJ in those head-to-head -head battles, Bird recognized something special in Jordan early on. After Jordan dropped a record-breaking 63 points against the Celtics in the 1986 playoffs, Bird famously said, and I quote, I think he's God disguised as Michael Jordan. That's not just respect, that's awe. Bird saw firsthand how Jordan's relentless work ethic and unmatched skill transformed the Bulls from a struggling team into a championship dynasty. Now, fast forward to today, and the GOAT debate is hotter than ever. Michael Jordan held the crown as the undisputed greatest player for years, especially after leading the Bulls to six NBA championships. But as LeBron James continues to add to his legendary career, the gap between MJ and LeBron is closing. A recent survey by The Athletic showed just how close it's getting. In 2023, the poll revealed that while MJ still held the majority of the votes as the GOAT, the margin between him and LeBron had narrowed significantly, 45.9% to 42.1%. Some are even saying that LeBron could overtake Jordan as the GOAT as early as next year after he's just captured an Olympic gold medal. It's undeniable that LeBron has achieved incredible things in his career. His longevity, versatility and impact on the game are truly remarkable. But here's where Larry Bird's words come into play. Bird's statement and I quote, I know in all my time he was better than all of us, carries a different kind of weight. It's not modern based or based on polls or analysis. It's coming from a player who was on the court, facing Jordan at his peak. Current NBA players, analysts and fans may lean towards LeBron because they've witnessed his dominance firsthand. But Bird's endorsement of Jordan as the best of his time is a powerful reminder that Michael's greatness wasn't just about numbers or championships, it was about the way the game was played how he dominated mentally and physically, and how he could take over a game like no one else. So what do we make of all of this? What do we make of Bird's comments? The GOAT debate might never have a definitive answer. It's subjective, and it's influenced by the era you grew up watching. But when someone like Larry Bird, who played against the greatest players of the 80s and early 90s, says that Michael Jordan was better than everyone, including himself, it's something we just can't ignore. Bird's words might just be the biggest endorsement Michael Jordan has ever got. It's not just about what MJ did, it's about who he did it against and how those players viewed him. And in Larry Bird's eyes, there was simply no one better. What do you guys think? Does Larry Bird's statement settle the GOAT debate or does it just add another layer to the conversation? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more upcoming videos and NBA content. My name is Damien Peters. As always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.